what's good bit rushers it's Kyler and in today's video we're going to go over an up and coming token to the polka dot ecosystem Kylin network if that sounds good to you stick around for everyone who's new please follow me on social media facebook instagram twitter you can also join the telegram chat for a little bit of extra access and currently we are in the second round of my token rush token presale if you want access to that go ahead and check out the link in the description token.bit-rush.com all right guys let's get into it kylin or kalin network i'm not sure exactly how you um, pronounce that i believe it's kalin um but yeah so building a cross-chain platform powering the data economy on polka dot Essentially what these guys are doing is bringing analytics to the Polkadot blockchain as well as a few other things and we can just take a look here. So technical architecture. Um, Kalin Network offers any application in blockchain such as parachains and parathreads instantaneous but reliable valid on off chain market data and social data sources by leveraging the power of Polkadot slash substrate framework on open networks. Uh, yeah, so in right off the bat, guys, I, I should just mention that up top it says there's no official public sale or listing. Uh, they haven't announce when they're coming out yet so i just want to give you guys an overview so you're ready when they do announce however the kyl token is not out okay so just keep that in mind um Kalin data analytics is a combination of analytic tools designed for data warehouses it provides a query engine and restful api for third-party applications and external analytical tools so this is going to be big guys um you know once if you want big business and um you know, essentially, the second layer of the internet is what we're looking for with the blockchain, right? If we actually want that to happen, we need to be able to have things like this where we can pull API, we can um, pull data and access that data with the API, all kinds of stuff like that. So this is going to be big for them to add to the Polkadot network. Um, we also have a, a data oracle, right? So it's an advanced decentralized data feeding protocol powered by Polkadot Substrate offering multiple real-time data sources with complementary to and synergy with off-chain workers. So they're going to be able to, um, yeah, essentially be in synergy with some different off-chain um, oracles as well, I guess, and be able to pull that data and, um, you know, I, I'm not sure exactly all the technicals on that, but sounds cool, so... <laughs> Um, let's see, Data Marketplace is an open platform for data exchange and pricing, so buying and selling of the data. And let's see, the native token Kalin Network will play a role in governance and other utilities. KYL is necessary to re uh, secure and power the decentralized data network. If you guys want, you can discover Polkadot, discover Substrate here, give you a little bit more information. Uh, I'm just going to go over a few of the pieces of the puzzle, the data consumer, we have the data warehouse, we have the oracles, the miner, and we have the, um, the arbiter, I guess, is guarantees the security and accuracy of external data by verifying the data integrity and validity of the oracle node provided. Um, and then you have the node, which is the actual validators. The bottom layer of the Clint Oracle is mainly built on a specialized blockchain network established by Substrate. Token economics, the Kalin Network mainnet token KYL is necessary to secure and power decentralized data. The use cases and utility of KYL include, but not limited to, um, so you can stake if you wanna actually um, become a miner and arbiter. Uh, there's an intermediary of exchange and on-chain governance so a few things you can do with the tokens guys uh these guys did win the um grant from the web3 foundation so i expect that this is a big project here in 2021 of decentralized insurance automatic payments stable coins and crypto derivatives crypto asset lending cross-chain decentralized exchange decentralized casinos and games blockchain computing and markets. So this is what I was saying, like all these kind of like second layer things that we want to build on the blockchain, we need to be able to have a system like this, a data system and an Oracle built. Um, you can come in here and see all their team members. They do have like LinkedIn's and the real profiles and always that and everything like that, which is always good to see. 
and we have all their strategic investors, the media, and the roadmap here. So 2020 Q4 private testnet release. So I imagine they are in the private testnet right now, guys. And hopefully coming into 2021, we'll start to see this token released. Um, definitely going to be a big one, so keep it on your radar. And again, right here, we have the Web3 Foundation grants program. I was already mentioning that. So these guys received money from the Web3 Foundation, which was founded by Gavin Woods himself. So um, I, what I did is I just opened up a page that has all of the accepted grant applications, guys. And you can see there's a whole bunch of them here, starting in um, the first quarter of 2019, all the way through the fourth quarter of 2020. Just a ton of stuff. So Polkadot ecosystem is really just starting to get started. Um, we're going to see a lot of this stuff launch soon, very, very soon. And not all of these are coins, guys, so keep that in mind. Not each one of these is going to be a token. Some of them are wallets and dApps and different um, pieces of the ecosystem. But there's a lot of stuff, guys, right? So expect that. Um, in 2021, we're going to cover Polkadot and Polkadot tokens a lot here. Um, if you aren't familiar with Polkadot, definitely go back and watch some of my other videos. I'll break it down to you like this. Polkadot is going to be Ethereum in 2021, right? This is the new Ethereum, um, except it's not an Ethereum killer. It actually works with Ethereum and builds on Ethereum, works cohesively with Ethereum, which is why I'm so bullish on it, because it taps into the network that Ethereum has already built and um, makes it even greater, makes it faster, makes it more secure, makes it more reliable, makes it more advanced. So just so many more things that we're gonna be able to do here on Polkadot. Um, keep an eye out for everything in the ecosystem here 2021. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something. Um, not a whole lot of information out just yet on Kai Lin, but as more information comes out, I'll continue to cover this project. If you enjoyed this video, please do smash the thumbs up, share with any friends or family you think may also want to learn about the Kai Lin token. Happy crypto. Let's get that coin.